In this video, we show you how you can manage users, roles, and permissions in your application. By default, all users have access to all parts of your application. If you require more control, you can make pages to manage access. To get started, we go to Design and then User Flows. Adding user management is easily done using the User Flow wizard. We choose for the wizard called User Management. Now we can choose which properties of users we want to see on the user management pages. Then we name the new user flow, in this case, user management. Our user flow has now been created. As you can see, user management allows you to create, edit, and deactivate users. Furthermore, you can assign roles. To create roles, however, you will need a separate user flow. Roles and permissions management can also be created using the user flow wizard. This time, we choose Roles and Permissions. For this user flow, all we have to do is give it a name. Our Roles and Permissions flow is now done. As you can see, this user flow allows you to create, edit, and assign user roles. You can also set permissions per role. Permissions are given on a user flow level, so you can give users access to one or more user flows. That's how easy it is to make user and role management and trigger. Only thing that's left to do is add the user flows to the application menu under Appearance. 